It's so nice. This is totally not a guy thing, I promise. So it's been nearly a year since we last took the Leopard to a six out, at least in a video format. This is a vehicle I take out quite frequently over on the streams, but I know many of you guys don't check those out. So I figured, you know what, let's kind of dive right back into this vehicle because there really hasn't been too much, I guess, about this vehicle that has really changed. And I know that's not something you guys want to hear, but hear me out. There has been one thing that has been driving the, I guess, the wearaboos, I like to say, okay, I mean that in a friendly way, I promise. It has been driving them nuts. Now, ever since, I think, uh, update, was it new power? No, it was shortly after that, okay, at some point. There was a significant change to the Russians, and I mean, this almost made their vehicles probably 100% better, at least in my opinion, and that is vertical targeting speed. Now, if you take a look at the, uh, the T80 BVM, you can see 40 degrees a second. This is an aced crew, by the way. It's about 36, 38, give or take, with an expert crew or non-expert crew. Uh, and then if you take, take a look at the T72B3, the exact same thing. Now, this kind of made a lot of my German friends, as well as my mains, very upset because, wait, why do the Russians get the better vertical targeting speed? They've never been known to have really good stuff outside and... Excuse my little chihuahua kind of reverse sneezing in the background right now. She's just, I don't know what she's doing. Anyways, so she's okay. She does it a lot, I promise. Anyways, so it made them very upset. And now Gaijin decided to do one thing and kind of, I wouldn't necessarily say cave into the demands because this is, at least as far as I know, very realistic. I mean, I can't say it is or isn't because I personally don't know. And that is now that the Germans, all of the Leopard 2s, by the way, I'm talking the Stris Ford, or the uh, STRV uh, 122A, the B, the 2A5, the 2PL, I think even the 2K? No, the 2K still kind of sucks, but okay. Not as a vehicle, but the vertical targeting speed. But no, check this out. With an aced crew, and I did do this naturally, by the way, 40 degrees a second which puts it on par with the russians i mean that's kind of a weird way to go about it but that's honestly the truth and you'll notice it too i mean you can really notice this when you're doing snapshots when you're trying to acquire targets from a distance very quickly especially in close range i mean good turret traverse and vertical targeting speed can make all the difference in a i guess in a knife fight in a phone booth does that make sense which happens quite frequently at top tier but i'd rather go ahead and kind of show you guys in some normal gameplay and i'll try to point it out as best as i can but this is not going to be a detailed review video because again nothing has really changed tm53 is still very good it's kind of wonky from time to time the vehicle is a little bit slower than what it used to be i guess i mean that maybe that's something i've noticed or maybe it's something that's untrue but either way let's go ahead and take this bad boy out and see if it really does make a bit of a difference i mean i have hundreds of hours in this vehicle alone so maybe i can notice it and share it with you guys who knows let's get started <sighs> You know, it's funny, it's gonna be a tradition now where we only ever play night games. I'm not even kidding, it's just... Uh, it's all right, I did a stream earlier today and it was just nothing but night game in the same map, back to back. Uh, what is variety? I have no idea. Anyways, let's make this good, yeah? I did bring a few extra rounds, uh, more than I'm comfortable with, and I'm just gonna snipe because DM53 is damn good at that. Got one front. There's one. Right in his engine. Right where I want it. Beautiful. And give me another boot, please. There's another good boot. Run his engine again. Let's try to... You know what's funny is I could burn him out. But I want to knock him out instead. There we go. Next hit should do him in. He's cooking, too. <laughs> nice. You know, one thing I've noticed about DM53 over its lifetime is the post ban effect of it has been kind of mediocre. I don't know if anyone else has noticed that, but it's been kind of weird lately. What's this? Got someone. Got him. Leclerc. He's pulling back by now. No, he ain't going to stay there. That's the... I'm sorry. That's the funny thing about the Leclerc. It's a fantastic vehicle, but its armor is kind of potato. Is that a live... That is definitely a live tank. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor little Bradley. Uh, I'm going to go into the city and fight because there's really nothing happening out here. Oh, there he is. He's cooking. Got him. Oh, actually, that wasn't the one we were looking at. That's weird. Oh, there's another one. Oh, damn. Oh, there's another one right there. Is that their spawn? It is. Sorry, boys. 
Oh, he's a fresh spawn, too. Hey, listen. I'm halfway across the field, okay? You can't get on my butt about this. Oh. I think I kind of deserve that one. I'm going to call that karma. Sure. Yeah, we'll go with that. Karma. Cool. Awesome. And the cool thing is, you end up burning down. So we got four kills. Uh, better than the whole team, but still. Let's uh, let's keep it going. Oh, he's alive. Whoop. Oh, God. I hate this laser range finder sometimes. Come on. There we go. Right, I got his commander, his breach. He's not shooting back for a little bit. It, he, I thought he was dead. That's why I, I kind of hesitated. Like, what? All right. And he popped smoke. Ooh. Uh, this is dangerous. Come on. There we go. Beautiful. Another Leclerc. By the way, we did get the assist on that other Leclerc, too. So we're at uh, just one now. Yeah. So uh, a little piece of advice really quick. Did you know you can slave your weapon? I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone knows this, but the uh, Leopard 2s don't have good gunner sights. They have very good... Uh, there we go. They have very good, uh, well, CITVs. And I fire. Oh, okay. So you're able to control the weapon like that and do exactly what I just did, more or less, and use Gen 2 sights on the Leopards, which is a nice thing. By the way, there's a helicopter over here who is... Uh, it's kind of scary, just saying. <laughs> oh, and there's one right there, too. Come on. Get out of here. There we go. Goodbye, pilot. I'm going to take a wild guess. Is that the same Abrams we shot at earlier? Come on. Oh, I'm super exposed. Yep. Oh, I can't see him. I can't see. There he is. Come on. Come on. There we go. Break his breach. Or I can take his life. That works too. <laughs> uh, thank you, Gentoos. Oh. Really? Really? Come on. Keep going. There you go. Oh, overshot. Come on. I swear I'm not this bad of a shot. There we go. Now he's, he's still. Yeah, we're, we're going to act like that didn't happen. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. Oh. Wait, where? Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh. Damn. Damn. <laughs> <I> just... <laughs> that was some good post pen. I'll give it that. Oh, why hello? Let's try this. Oh no, he's a fresh spawn. Yeah, you can actually use the commander sight as you would your gunner, and it's super nice too. Let's try one more time. There we go. That is actually so nice too. It's just it looks good. I don't know. I'm a huge fan of Sim. I haven't been playing Sim as of late because of all the freaking helicopters happening but this oh really ricochet yeah sure awesome anyways uh i haven't been touching it because of all the freaking helicopters in the game they just completely ruined the experience entirely i mean imagine a seven on seven but the entire entire enemy team is k52 yeah Ooh, nice dip dude that's rude where who's shooting me oh hey buddy <laughs> oh that's a chrysler Oh, no. He's bound. He's got a friend right behind him. There we go. Let's get him to lower, lower, lower. Oh, no. He's dead. Oh, never mind. He's dead. He's been dead. Hmm. There might be someone. So it is. In truth, I... Uh... Come on. Oh, there he goes. Come on, come on, come on. Fire, 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 fire. There we go. Beautiful hit. I was going to say, in truth, even though I'm about to rack up, I think my 11th kill, I don't really feel like I'm doing too well. Does that make sense? There we go. <laughs> 11 kills. And I, I feel like I'm not really benefiting the team too much. It's just it's a mental thing, I think. Oh, I had to open my big mouth, didn't I? Dude, ugh. Night games back to back. Come on. Okay, watch. The third one after this one is going to be a night game again. Just watch. Just watch, okay? Guy just got it out for me. I know they do. Oh, ho, ho. you know what that sound is. That sounds like a juicy Abrams coming up right in front of me. Oh, yes. 
me a quick second here while I find him and then just give him a good boop. Got his breach. Oh, and here's his attempt of uh, going reverse. Yep. I said attempt. Ah, uh, sorry, little man. And another boop here, please. Thank you. Always oh, got friends, though, I think. I'm leaving now. I've got what sounds like another Abrams front. It could be Ninja's TVL because apparently they sound alike. Uh, no, I, I hear him. Oh, it's too bright. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to blind your eyes like that. And I think we got him right coming up here. Ooh, okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, we actually bounced that off that guy, too. We're good. We're backing up. A few moments later. Hey, what if I do that again? I guess it'll turn out really well. <laughs> yeah, it's, that's called playing with fire, okay? And I could have easily gotten burned. And another Abrams to my right. Uh, give me a second. Let me deal with this guy up front, and then I'll go ahead and cap that point. Yeah, I know, I know. He's coming up behind me now. Never mind, he's coming up behind. Here he comes. Oh, yeah, he's definitely coming this way. And boop. Oh. See what I mean about the reaction time with the barrel? I'm not even kidding. It's really nice. <laughs> and he's... Oh, no. Now you're bone, dude. Sorry. All right, let's take the, uh, the C point, yeah? Oh. Know what that is. <laughs> that's, uh... That's an Abrams or an HSTVL. And apparently the ADAT's just... Sure, that was incredibly rude. Oh. Well, then. I think I kind of earned that one. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, if you guys didn't know, the um, Type 90 did just die. And apparently this guy as well. Snapshot. Oh, he's got a friend. He's got a lot of friends. Oh, I got zero trust. No thanks. Backing off. Yeah, one more thing too is I'm going to try to not get another night game in the in the video because I'm just, I'm sure you guys are going to get sick of seeing it so often. I, I would. Uh-oh. And M1A2 just killed my teammate. I'm going to try something. I'm going to uh, ambush him by hanging out behind his dead teammate. So if I turn off my engine here. Yeah, here he comes. And I kind of use his, like, the, the heat off this vehicle to hide myself, my hide my uh, thermal signature. Here he comes. There he is. He was... Well, he wasn't aware of me anyway, so I guess that was pointless. <laughs> Let's take that C point now, for real. Got a teammate who just died over here. Dude, how many Abrams... Uh, great, I got his barrel, too. How many Abrams are we getting over here? Abrams my right. I got several Abrams, I think. Yep, here he comes. Got his gunner, turret ring, track. Oh yeah, he's boned. This this guy is royally boned. He actually hurt my engine. There's two Abrams over here. I hear them both. Two distinct engines. Nope. Maybe it wasn't. Oh, it was the same guy too. I am terribly sorry, dude. Oof. No, it was just one, two. Hmm? Oh, I'm dead. Oh, <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. I hear something behind me. Oh, good play. Also, last game, I uh, I made a, a sin. I carried more than, I think, what, 18 rounds or 20. I, I carried 21 personally, but I carried like more than 18. And uh, yeah, thankfully we didn't blow up because of it. But here's one thing, if you guys didn't notice, if you carry 21 rounds in the SDRV 122A or the or I think it's both. I can't tell. I forget. Uh, you lose the lower uh, stowage in the hole while carrying 21 in the turret. Although there's only supposed to be 16 or 15 up here. It's kind of weird how it works, but hey, you know what? I'll take it. Oh, this is a bad spot. Oh, this is a terrible spot. I got to move now. Okay, I'm probably putting myself in a really, really bad spot, but you know what? We got teammates behind us. It may pay off. There's one. I hear a second one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's amazing how loud the Abrams engine is. 
Alright, let's move forward. Let's see if we can get him. I got one more front. He's dead. I got another one. Come on. Is that a type 90? No, that's a leopard. Wait, is that a leopard? Uh, pop and smoke. Get one more shot on him. There we go. And on my right. There he is. Go ahead, break his barrel. Kind of scummy, I know, but it's, it's a viable tactic. And hey, buddy. Boop. Oh, I got another one right here. Another one on my right. Are we mixed? Oh, we're slightly mixed. Okay. And striker. Bender horizontal. Keep running, boy. Keep running. Yeah, he's... <laughs> he's slightly gone. I'm coming. Nope. Thanks for popping smoke, buddy. Thanks for giving me cover. Oh... Actually turning into a really good fight. There's another one. Ooh, I messed up my shot. Damn it, I couldn't save you. I'm sorry, man. He backed up. I'm good. I got him. I got him. I got him. Oof. Ooh. Four rounds to the ready rack. This is one hell of a knife fight. Popping smoke to cover my ass. And one more to my... I might get shot in my ass right now. Pop and smoke again. Okay. Hey, buddy. That was gonna hurt. Oh, he missed his shot. Poor thing. Woo. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I had to celebrate too early, didn't I? I just got shot in the ass. Yep. I'm boned. I don't know where that came from. Yep, that was a good fight though. Eight kills, I'll take it. Let's bring out the backup. Uh, uh I forgot to bring the backup. <laughs> you know what? Ah! Uh, oh. Oh, this time we're playing with the Americans versus everybody else. And not France. <laughs> How many French are there? Hold up, we got one. We got one poor Frenchman in here. Oh no! <laughs> Hey, I think I should do a little revisit on the, the Claire. What do you guys think? Yeah? I don't know. Let me know down in the uh, the comment section, guys. I'm curious now. There's only one! Poor little thing! Watch him do the best. I hope he does. Yeah, this is called uh, running a gauntlet. I might die doing this. But you can damn well bet I'm going to try to take anyone with me. Whoever tries to engage me. Come on. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Um... In truth, I... Okay, I'll go this way. I was going to say, I have no idea where I'm going right now. Ooh, I've got several. There's one. Not one. Not one. Not one. Shoot the wedge. Shoot the... Okay. I'm not shooting the wedge. Knocked out his breach. Beautiful. Come on. There we go. Lovely. And they got the... Uh, whatever was behind him. I think it was the CV90-120. Let's get to that B point, yeah? Oy! Oh, no. Oh, no. Where was that? There it was. Ish, I think. Yeah, I know you see me. I just lazed you. It's an Italian boy. Don't do it. I told you not to do it. Can I... Can I throw the needle? Yes! <laughs> oh, that was exciting. I'm sorry. Volumetric, my ass. Nice. All right, we're out of here. Ooh. Ooh, hold up. Oh, really? Ugh, off with your head, buddy. I'm terribly sorry. Uh, I've got other SPAs to chew on. And this guy, apparently. Hmm. Was that the same guy we just killed earlier? Uh. Yes, it was. I am terribly sorry, my friend. I know how it feels like. What? What is that? Oh. It's an RCV. I, I was wondering, like, what sounds like... It it's got a busted engine and well now it really does but point being that's a rare sight hmm might do that myself one day yeah you know the shameful part too is this game ended pretty damn quick <laughs> it's it's amazing how quickly the enemy team kind of falls right now 
and it does not reinforce that whole Germany suffers thing, except that we are now going to get what? Si oh, that's so loud. Holy crap. Uh, we're not, we're gonna get what? Six leopard twos now? I think there's a guy right here. Okay. Yeah, there's a dude right here, and he's right there. Sort of got him. You want to finish him? Come on. Doink. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Are you guys excited for the crafting event? Uh, I'm 50-50, you know. We'll, we'll see. Okay. I'm going to say this map I actually kind of enjoy, but there might be a little bit of a personal bias behind it because it says, or happens to have the name, American Desert. Yeah, just, just a little bit of bias, I promise. Anyways, this will be some fun night fights, I think. Oh, I missed that. Damn it. Boop. Oh, nice shot, though. Nice return. Oh, that's, that wasn't a return shot. That was somebody else. Oh, I'm going to die now. Come on, back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Come on. Uh, don't give me a lag spike here, please. Woo. Oh, that was my bad luck, I guess. Damn. Look at that, guys. It's the stealthy MI-28 that makes no sound. The only thing you hear is the sound of the guns. Uh, come on, it's been like, what, two weeks since the patch dropped and that's still happening? Come on, Gaijin. Help us out of here, buddy. There's somebody right in front of me. There's an Abrams, too. Ooh, ooh, hold up. Oh, give me something to kill, please. Come on. I only have one assist. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> our, our team is doing really well right now. We're just, we're kind of stomping their faces pretty easily. <laughs> Oh, this is not going to be a good last clip. I can already tell, I think. Oh, is that a Sheridan? That's a Sheridan. What the hell are you doing up there, buddy? Uh, I think he kind of got the idea. Or sort of had the idea that that was a bad spot. You know what? Props for trying, buddy. There was somebody behind him. I think we can follow up right here. Yes. Beautiful. Sorry, guys. Just passing through here, trying to get to Charlie. Don't mind me. Huh? Yeah, I hear him. There he is. Think he sees me? Well, he does see me. Doesn't really help his situation out anymore. Yeah, sorry, buddy. I got a shit long reload, too, so. Yeah, yeah, I know. Run away. Boop. See what I mean about the whole snapshots thing going on? Like, really well because of the extra 40 degrees of vertical targeting speed. Or extra 20, excuse me, from the original 20. It's really nice. I'm running away now. I don't know what that was. Oh. That's what that was. All right, let's try this. There he is. Nice. I'll take it. Yeah. That was, uh, that was pretty exhilarating. The Leopard 2A6 is one that never disappoints, and it's one that I will always see, or at least place as one of the best MBTs in the game. One of them, not the best, but amongst them for certain. And having that extra vertical targeting speed upped up from 20 to now 40, doubling it, that's actually really nice i mean it's, it's incredibly nice to be able to have that because it did feel a little sluggish i mean playing my abrams yeah sure it can get the job done it did get it done quite well but now that it has that little extra push to it it does make this vehicle at least in my opinion that much more formidable in a close scene engagement and remember this is widespread throughout all of the leopards at least all the higher tier ones leopard 2a5 also got its uh, buff as well as did the swedish with their 122 so if we go ahead and take a look at it really quick 40 degrees remember aced crew and my b model which is also an aced crew 40 degrees which is very nice although I still think this should get the M95 now that it got kind of nerfed a little bit, but that's just me. And that's for a different video on a different day. So back to the Germans themselves. In truth, the 2A6, at least in my opinion, is still, it's stupid fun. That's all I got to say about it, okay? In the right hands, it can do very well. In the wrong hands, well, it's an easy vehicle to kill for the most part. And if you don't know how to kill this thing, here's a little bit of a uh, piece of advice. Right here, upper front plate, depending on what you're shooting, anything above DM33 or 3BM42 will go through here just fine. 
or the neck area right here, which if you have good post pen effect, it will destroy the vehicle quite quickly. And I mean, when I say quickly, I mean, holy crap, this thing will die in one shot almost every single time, at least from the breach area, depending on what shell type you're using. So yeah, that's all I got for you guys. Uh, it just nothing really else to add on to it, to be honest. It's nice to see this vehicle still be highly formidable uh, throughout the year. And I don't really see another reason as to why we might have to see a different variant of the Leopard unless they decide to add the uh, the armor package on this thing. Leopard 2A6 EX or something like that. I, I don't know. It's just I'll, I'll let you wear boos figure that out for me, okay? So with all that being said, if you guys want to go ahead and see this gameplay live, I usually play mostly top tier during the streams. So feel free to check out that Twitch link down below in the description and let me know exactly what you think about the new changes as well as what you think about this vehicle in general, okay? I know a lot of you have opinions on it, but... Let's hear this out, okay? Soon, Germany's going to have six Leopard 2s. All right, let that sink in. Six Leopard 2s. Okay, cool, awesome, yeah. But anyways, thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll see you not only in the next video or even the streams, but in War Thunder itself. Until next time.